took our Miranda Sings doll across the country to see Miranda Sings perform live. We traveled from California all the way to Georgia. Georgia was beautiful and green and it had a lot of trees something we're not used to seeing back home in California. Because this was a quick four-day trip, we had to pack light. So everything that the doll needed got packed in my suitcase. So let's open it up and see what we brought. Even though this was a quick trip, Miranda never travels without her fan art. So we made sure to bring her wall of art with us. That way she feels at home when she sets up. We also brought some iron-on vinyl decals for our purple sweatshirts, that's for the show. And then stuck right in the back of the suitcase is Miranda. We had to use one of our smaller travel totes just so it would fit in the carry-on. This tote is from Girls and Company. We showed you their dolls and reviewed them a few months ago. And her suitcase was packed separately. So let's zip that out and see what she has. We have several doll suitcases, including ones that we've crafted, but this one is from our generation. So here is the travel tote unzipped. As you can see, it really only fits the doll, but it does fit the doll nicely, and you can still stuff a few accessories around the side of the doll if you need to, like her brush, of course her lipstick, she'll need that. And in the suitcase, you've seen us review this set by Our Generation. You can find it at Target. She has her toiletries, like her floss, her shampoo, her toothbrush, and then her camera because she wants to take pictures of all of her fans at the show. And she brought a little bag. So this is nice. It's like a little purse. And this is one of my favorite bags from American Girl. It is a little bit older. Oh, let's see what fell out. We have some lip gloss and an American Girl gift card. We'll be shopping there later. Oh, a real thing of lipstick for the doll. And this is lipstick that we crafted for the doll. So check out that video if you haven't made that craft yet because it's really easy and it's so cute for the dolls to have. Stick it in their purse, stick it on their vanity. Oh, it looks like Miranda brought some money. She tends to do some shopping while she's here in Georgia. Her little debit card. She brought a little Barbie to keep her company in case she wants to play. And she has a pin so she can sign her autograph for all of her fans. One of the things that the Miranda doll was excited about coming to Georgia was to meet up with her longtime friend, Caroline. Oh, hello, Caroline. Sweet Caroline. What the heck? What is going on with your hair? Doesn't your uncle do yours? Mine is beautiful and legit, and yours is very messed up. So you need to sort that out. As you can see, Miranda was right. Caroline's hair is a hot mess. We've had Caroline for a really long time and I'm not quite sure what has happened to her hair, but we do know that we need to fix it. So here we've taken it out of the braid and out of the bun and as you can see, it just looks like a little rat's nest. It's frizzy and clumped together. So we're gonna do a hot water dunk just to try to fix the damage that's been done and possibly a small trim just to get rid of any of the uneven edges because it looks pretty damaged. So the first thing we're gonna do is boil some water on the stove top. Once it comes to a boil, then we're gonna remove it and let it cool down for a little bit because we don't want it boiling while we dip the doll's hair in it. We've placed the hot water in a bowl so it's easier to reach with the doll's hair. We've also covered our surface with the towel. And as you can see, Caroline's head is no longer attached to her body. Caroline is a drawstring doll which means that we were able to untie her head and just pull the head off. This way we don't get her body wet. But if you're doing this with a doll that has a zip tie around the neck, you'll need to be very careful to make sure you don't get her body wet and you need to cover her face so you don't get any water in her eyes. 
You also want to be very careful that when you're dipping the hair, you don't go all the way to the scalp because you don't want to get water underneath the wig cap. You don't want to loosen any glue, so just brush out the doll's hair and then dip it in the water and then you might have to redo it a couple of times on the same piece. Caroline's hair might have looked really bad, but it only took two dunks per section for her hair to get right back to normal. Repeat this process for all of the hair. Make sure you don't get it on the doll's face, in her eyes, and don't go all the way to the scalp. So here is Caroline after her hot water dunk treatment. Her hair is dried a little bit and we've reattached her head. We've brushed everything out and everything looks great except for the very ends of her hair. It still looks a little damaged. If you do this, you need your parents' permission and you probably need help, but you'll just wanna trim off the very edges of her hair. And the American Girl Doll Salon does this all the time when they're doing hair, when they brush it out and they wet it. They're just cutting off the uneven pieces. And even though Caroline only needed a small trim on her ends, she begged and begged for a shorter haircut. So we gave it to her. But be sure not to cut your doll's full hair at home. Let's see what Miranda has to say about her friend's new do. Oh, you look so much even goodlier. Not as goodly as me. So don't even try to look more fabulous or so. While in the South, Miranda enjoyed foods that she doesn't get on the West Coast, like Zoe's Kitchen, Southern Biscuits and Gravy Chips, Mellow Mushroom Pretzels, and Pizza. She might have caused a few head turns at the restaurants. <laughs> After some fun and dancing, we made it to the show in Alabama. Let's check out the line an hour and a half before the show starts. was a long line, and it's not even close to the doors opening yet. Stop recording me and payment. We knew there was one AGI fan in the crowd. But we didn't think we'd see them. There were thousands of people there. We sat right next to them. How crazy cool is that? Oh, this show is about to start.
want to see Miranda Sings live full show, come back for tomorrow's video. Really? You just bounced the video. <laughs> Casey, no, that's wrong.